Hello and welcome to Fallen Plays Total War Shogun 2 Fall of the Samurai campaign. So let's go straight ahead and choose a clan. So these are the clans you can decide from. Um, these here are the Shogunate. Uh, they're under the Shogunate uh, side there. Um, Civil War in Japan um, in around 1864. Um, and these are the Imperial. So let's have a look. So we've got Chosa, um, initial challenge, easy, provinces one, um, usually you read these parts, these parts are good but these are the main areas which affect you, uh, conditioning, movement, to be, that's pretty good, um, plus 10 to casualties when using sabotage and house restrictions, so that's like uh, if you get a shinobi um, and sabotage an army it will affect them more. Uh, Guerrilla Warfare, um, plus 6% to uh, possible number of Yukichiri units. Um, so I thought I was that wrong. Um, I'm not sure what that is at all. Resource resourcefulness. Armies um, can be punished in um, enemy territory. Winter Wolves accepted. Okay, that's pretty good as well. Um, so you can have more like ammunition as far as you can and match lock units and things like that on the name of Uh we said AU initial challenge is hard uh province is one uh, they are traditionalists defence minus ten percent costs of construction castles uh, minus ten percent um improvement of all costs to traditional units that's good discipline minus ten percent of the cost of I send scenes. Oh, I can't pronounce that. Send scenes. Uh, actions. Again, if I'm saying that wrong, um, I'm sorry. Traditional. Plus one percent of experience. So they look quite promising. That's a good. Um, so all players who are new to it for the Samurai campaign. Um, well, I've, I've heard many suggestions for as you. Uh, to be playing. Uh, probably the easiest to start off with. Um, so we're going to Nego Negoka Enterprise plus 10% to income from business chain buildings. Foreign trade uh, minus 15% .50 to the recruitment costs of modern units. Oh, that's pretty good. Um, not like matchlock kinds, western units. Like. Uh, the Navy, what do you call him? Uh, Royal Navy, and there's, there's, there's some American unit, forgotten the names. Entertainment, plus time for Geisha actions. Um, Altricity, uh, plus 15% for two loading loading skills. Okay, and there's these. Um, so easy administration costs, leadership, personalization. Dominion, uh, starts with two provinces, that is. Toja, um, plus 10% to diplomatic relations, respect reduction to resistance to occupation across all provinces, plus two naval bombardment range, to plus two experience for all cruise ships, ship crews. Chosu, uh, zero. Minus 10% of cost in Shin Shizi actually. Adaptability minus 10% of the cost of military buildings and units. Uh, Maragiling uh, plus 25% from looting. Uh, impetus uh, plus 3% plus, plus 3 to charge bonus of all units. And then Tushu. Uh, Tushu. And I've got a sign of T. Uh, persuasion, uh, 2% of average conversion, uh, 30% of uh, plus 3% of the number of Kishiro Ninja units available, uh, Fortitude, plus 1% to unit military defense, and uh, plus 5% no reactions. So, anyway, so what I was saying before is I've been suggesting as you uh, thought about a doing these guys, doing them so yeah I'll go with them. Uh, go to Blanco Cain, 
Let's go to. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be hard. Okay. More options than you want to. I don't know. Um, let's go to back time in 20 minutes. And. Uh, uh, so, whilst this is loaded, I've uh, got some updates for you all. Um, there is some DLC at the end of this month, 30th of November, coming out with Total War. Um, it's the Otomo Clan Pack. Um, that's um, what campaign, uh, single player, multiplayer, you have the choice of uh, being them. Um, I've done some research here and apparently they have great economic and military benefits from the allegiance with the Portuguese. Ah. And they have new units such as the Portuguese Turcos. Okay. Uh, After the this. Sengoku Jidai, peace reigned for 200 years. In Kyoto, the Emperor continued as divine head of state. But real power was held by the Tokugawa Shogunate. For two centuries, they ruled with absolute authority. Japan prospered. The people were content. In 1853, American warships changed everything. The Shogun welcomed the West and signed the Treaty of Peace and Amity. The gates to Japan were open. Trade was established, but the agreements favored the Western powers. The economy faltered and the people suffered in 1863, the Emperor overruled the Shogun. An imperial decree ordered the expulsion of all Western powers. Ten years of diplomacy cast into the sea. Western powers gave the answer. To run out the guns. On my command, fire! The Emperor brought death to his people. The imperialists would pay for their misguided actions. Order had to be restored. To strengthen our position, the Shogun allied with the French. We will study their ways and discover their secrets. Only then can we destroy the faults around the Emperor and return honor to Japan. The Shogun must be victorious. Okay, so that was I the stormy. introduction video to loyal okay. to the Tokugawa uh, Shogunate for yeah. centuries. Follow the samurai. Our family was granted okay. these lands and the clan name of Matsudaira in honor of our okay, service. So. 
The Boshin War is a conflict between the forces Again. of the Shogunate and those of the Emperor. Okay, so that was a mission issue. Every clan must uh, pledge allegiance to one or the other. So the object of the campaign the game is to secure now. allegiance um, to our cause and capture territory. Civil policies. Uh, when our clan's fame to... reaches a certain level, mm. we must choose to rally I'm gonna go for military one technologies, power or the other, uh, just because I want to capture to as many personal control of the country. provinces as soon as possible. So this that last will option will lead Arms to deals. all but uh, our most loyal allies modern, turning against us. What a military. Um, let's have a look at the diplomacy. Right. So we're at war with Utusimia. Uh, um, and they're like. Right next door to us, just me. Um, and we're allies very friendly with uh, Nagoka. Um, they, yeah, it's, uh, um, and we are Shogunate, obviously. Now, Shogunate, they're Imperial, they're Shogunate just above us, they could be allies with us. Uh, and they're Shogunate. So, um, trade with this province and um, they are moderately powerful, moderately prosperity. Um, so I think we should yeah. So trade In a spirit of friendship. Speak, speak of your terms and I will answer. And yeah, there we go. That's some trade. So if we now have a look at our trade panel, um I believe it's on the records. No, it's on the finance side. So, I can't get in a value of 80 something. I don't know what it is, but 80 something. Um, taxes starts as normal, yep. Um, actually, if I put it up to high, how mad are these guys? Minus one. That'll be fine. Um, white Tiger Force. Recruits in this game, maybe? Yeah. So we've got a couple of them. Um, what things? We've got, we've got police station, substance farming, harbour. Um, okay. Let's go for. Go put some money in the uh, farming. Do you know some income? Yes, my Police force, general. Oh, right, yeah, got general, that's good. So let's have a look at the family council general. Um, oh, we can't assign him any commissions for now. Um, not sure why that is. So we don't have any family yet. Um, As it's winter, um, with winter comes attrition. If you're in an enemy state, um, your units will have casualties, um, loss, causing loss of loss, loss of numbers. Um, so, seeing as we are uh, fighting these guys at the moment, I'm going to take my Senshugumi. Um, Inside the vault, is that saying? Oh, actually, let's see what happens if. So what we've got here is a telegraph office, um, which is quite useful in the future. You can uh, build a railway station. Railway stations can get you through the map very quickly. Um, so usually, what I look to do at the beginning of a campaign is lack of done. Um, so sort of looked, reviewed the diplomacy. Um, 
made some trade agreements and um, see who is around us. Um, Imperial. Um, so if we do go and attack these guys, they have trade partners as me too. Um, they might be unhappy about that. Let's have a look at me too. So their ranks are quite high in their um, products. So could just install a navy ship, two navy ships in their area. Just to keep watch. No. Um, And development sorted. Um, okay. Um, As you command. Well, As you command. We've been closer to the attacking force, so we're happy with these guys. These them and our allies on two lashes. So the allies actually have two two armies. Um Geisha um two they are uh, the allies with but the enemies with Matsui. Um so yeah let's end this turn and see what happens. So we've recruited that unit, um, two units, White Tiger Force, um, in our capital. Um, Your orders, my we're going to move these guys closer. Very well. Laying an ambush. And the army's gone out of the province there. Took out that too. Um, I want to make a large town, spend a bit of money, and okay, I'm happy. There's a um, objectives need to capture Yang Ashuri. Um, so this place isn't too far away. Let's get my feet. If we take that settlement, we'll be able to get theirs quite quickly. Sir? Might be worth whilst we can. Moving around here, seeing if we've got a new plan. The Koga. Who are the Koga? Ah, they're an imperial state. Okay, so I think we've done all for now this turn. At the beginning we do find up for a few turns. So what I'd like to mention is um my much favourite game, Rome, um, when I was a child. The Rome 2 is coming out in October um, 2013. Um, oh, capture the following province. Yeah. And um, definitely Ready for orders. looking to get that next year and do some gameplay for that. It'll be very exciting. So there's some other videos on my channel um, where you can see some of these, the screenshots and the trailers. If you take an interest in that. Or if you're new to the Total War um, franchise, just keep watching and get entertained. Okay. Oh, 
has been destroyed. So that's Koga. Or we just saw we sell for glory. Um Joseph. That's good, Joseph have taken them. So we could uh, unfortunately we can't do a trade for uh -huh. My sword for you, my lord. Laying in an ambush. on to this province. Um, I'll just yes, stand ahead with this wolf. Just to see what's going on. So what we have here is their army. Uh, I'm going to see what I can do to assassinate. And it calls through by clan leaders successfully as well. And then, oh, it's that revolt. Hmm. At your command. Right, so what I'm going to do is just spend our hide subunit an army there. And what I should have done is send some backup earlier. And uh, well, I think they're going to get too me. My sword for you. So I'll keep an eye on what this army does, whether it stays there. Hopefully, How can I it goes and does some exploration, and then I can just take the set on. Um, okay. Okay, we've got our construction of farm fuel so we could generate some more income from that. Okay, okay so we have retreated into the settlement. Um, and I'm going to see if I can be a bit tricky and start to revolt. Hmm, no, failed. Your orders, my lord. Let's get that a bit closer. Lying in wait. Um, hmm. Build a pot. I will rest here. Oh, that is good news. Um, their main army has taken a lot of troops out of their settlement, leaving the settlement pretty much open to attack. 
Um, so yeah, Ready let's go him. ahead and attack. Uh, we'll, we'll meet up As with you. Obedience is Time we will attack this settlement. So uh, goodbye for now, guys.